Uh, Yar! Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Fargus's ship sails with. Yeah. Uh, well, unless they spot so, a fog and shrouded <laughs> isle on the horizon. I'm just gonna be like, are you already kids? This whole video. Uh, of course. <laughs> well, this, that it was a short level, believe it or not. It, yeah, it was like 16 really? minutes. My, only, that my only regret talking. was we did not get the sweep staff. Which is really helpful, especially later in the game. Yes, it um, is. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you buddy! You don't get seasick, do you? <laughs> sea rover. Who yeah. says the word sea rover these days? That's not like a phrase, even back then. I don't <laughs> think. <laughs> the name's Rover. <laughs> Are you ready? Listen to me, lad. I can't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be okay. saying that. I think like SpongeBob, like I've seen the same like four episodes over. And over again. <laughs> yep. Like the, uh, splinter. the Splinter, which is surprisingly probably the best episode I've seen, which is kind of sad. It's pretty Actually, bad. no, no, best episode um, is the one where they put on the play in the prison. We only, do okay, it. That was Take pretty good. I've only seen that one one. I've seen Pearl's birthday like a bajillion times. Like that. I wonder it's like he thinks uh, Squidward thinks he's gonna die. Uh, he thinks gonna die. Was like, if I were to somehow like spontaneously combust due to the carelessness of a friend, well, that'd be okay. <laughs> How about the one where Spongebob's, like, weird nephew tries to get a job? Yeah, I've probably seen that a couple times, too. I yeah. didn't even watch that show. How have I seen, like... <laughs> I don't know! I've seen some of these episodes multiple times. I probably... I feel like I never really watched that show. Mm -hmm. It has what I'll call, like, Adventure Time Syndrome, where, but, like, even worse, where it's, like, Adventure Time, I feel like maybe, Very like, hit or miss. 40% of the episodes are good, and the rest are kind of just like, eh. But there are a few that are just like, this is, like, unwatchable. And yeah, there, but there are also some that are like this is amazing. Yep. And SpongeBob, meanwhile, is like mm, maybe one of out of every ten. Oh yeah, Ninian. She's in Lynn's story as well, and she plays a pretty big role in the plot of the game. She's cool. Spoiler alert. She's probably the best of the dancer characters. In what the about Tethys? Yeah, she's just like Jasmine's weird like <laughs> neighbor. <laughs> Jasmine's neighbor. Okay. She's from Sacred Stones. Check her out. She's basically. She's like, I don't know. She's kind of an Arabian dancer a little bit. There's like the Arabian music that plays when she Yeah, dances. it's like... Dar, 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 dar. She I, looks what like about um, Olivia from Awakening who has oh. this freaking sword? What is... Uh, she's pretty great. Um, what is that... Uh, uh, is it Shantae? Who? There's like a... It's about the people who do um, mutant muds and stuff. It's like a... What? Uh, it's like a 3DS game where you're like a genie. Like a little genie girl. Tethys looks like her, basically. Oh yeah, I do remember that. Um, I really also wish dude... you had Fargus on your team for this level. Oh, that would be great. <laughs> oh, dare we try to kill the boss? We'll see. It's very risky, because the boss... Well, we'll get into it when we start the level. This is like the first level for a while that we won't get a new character on. That's true. Uh, we get two on the next level to make up for come. it, though. This is a really risky one to take certain characters on. That was basically Qui-Gon. Uh, I, I guess. Alright, we need some more vulneraries for El I feel like, okay. Uh, well, actually, I guess I uh, already answered that question, but... I think that's um, What would you think if there was, like, a fully voice-talented Fire Emblem game? I know there's, like, some that have some voice talent, but, like... <sighs> I... I mean, like, I wouldn't say no to it, I guess. Okay, Florina... What is your opinion of, um, so, in the newest, um... Uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild trailer. It's revealed that there is voice talent, or at least some voice talent. Because right. there's like a. No, no, no. There's like a narrator who's like, Wake up, Link! Like, I, they haven't shown Link talking, but other people definitely have oh, voice talent. Oh, you said Zelda? Yes, for the new one, for the Wii U one. Wait, were you talking about Zelda for fully voice talented in the first place? No, I was talking about Fire okay. Emblem for that. Then I said, What's your opinion of Breath of the Wild, the new Zelda game, having voice talent? Oh, I do not think Zelda should have voice talent. See, if they do it, okay, if they do it where Link is still silent but everybody else talks, <laughs> I'm probably fine with it. Level 1 still. Probably not using Urk. Oh, I hope I get Pent. He's so good. You, I think you do. Yes. I think you get your choice of either Pent or Louise. Uh, 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 do you, do you that's... want to do any transferring? Mm. The short bow is mine. Yep, I know. I'm gonna transfer this. Uh, I might be willing to trade it for, like... Will. <laughs> I don't want Will. <laughs> I'll get Louise, most likely. Maybe Raph. Ooh, who needs skill? Um, I think Canis himself, or Canas himself. He at least would not say no to more skill. K 
Kent has pretty low skill. Oh, Matthew has really low skill. Really? Matthew gets pretty high skill normally. I think his level's up pretty much normally, though. You know what? I'll use it on him. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so we're picking units. So we can only have ten. Um, Darn it, why are there so many odd-numbered unit levels? Alright, well, I'm not breeding for Arena. I'll just say that right now. Wait, hang on, are things even right now? I have one extra guy. One, two, three. You might want to breed Matthew, because the boss does have speed wings. Yeah, I don't know if I'll be able to make it to the boss, though. So. I'm not gonna... I think Raven's too weak at this point. Like, he's just gonna die. It, honestly, though, there are quite a few axe users on this level, and if you don't use Raven on this level, it's gonna be very hard to level him up on later levels. That's true, but I'm gonna give him Volmeri, so... That's a good... that's a good decision. A wise decision, Frank. The fact that Raven attacks twice with a steel sword means... Oh, do we not have any? Uh, try trading with somebody. Hey, does Florina oh, have Volmeri? Oh, hit on, hit on, hit on. Oh, Will has Will them. Has them. You know, what would be, you know what would be great? Is if you could combine them. Yeah! Oh yeah, Lucius. Lucius is mine, though. I know. Um, okay. Do, 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 do. I don't want to take Priscilla, I don't think. That, 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 okay, that's fine. We're Actually, should we take... Should I take Priscilla and you don't take Sarah, maybe? I mean, I was... She's, she can move farther. That's all right. That's true. I, we I'm don't need trying to, to take Sarah on every level just to level her up. Alright, I'm gonna take... You probably want to take Kanas. Uh, yeah. It's up to you, though. Actually, he's really good if you've used him on this level at all, but... Yeah. Uh, I didn't get to choose my units. Oh, I thought you did. That's why I was asking you who you wanted. Well, I mean, I'll see who I have. You have, like, the guys you've been using for the last, like, however many levels. Oh, it's Jake. That was, uh, in his... Yeah. Oh, okay, wait. Oh, is that why you go to the inn? Well, he'll just basically tell you, that's, that's the armory, and that's the shop. Yeah, there are no shops on the Dread Isle, which is the next several levels. You have a good, you have a good cast. So I've got Elwood, Oswin, Lowen... Sarah. That's it. Hang on a second. One, two, three, four... Well, I only have four guys, what the heck? Oh, I almost... Oops, I misdoubted nope. and I took, like, eight guys. <laughs> nope, we're not doing that. <laughs> Wink's trying to swindle me. <laughs> no, I swear I'm not. Alright, All right. so no Florina. No Priscilla, No Priscilla, said? I said. Uh, okay. Okay, so hang on, hang Yeah, on. you took an extra guy and I was That's left That's because you told me guy. to take Raven. I forgot to balance that out after that. Um, out of those, I'm not taking Raven. You're not taking Raven? Alright, you want Kanas though? No, because then I'm already over. Right? No, you're not. Because I've got Elwood, Lowen, Oswin, Sarah, and Lynn. You've got Hector, Kent, Matthew, Rebecca, and Kanas. It's even. Mm. Five apiece. Should I take Kanas or Raven? I'm going to take a Raven. Raven, because he's a lower level. Kanas is pretty yeah, good. Yeah, he's level. fine. Alright, we'll do that. And then. there are a lot of X users. I'm taking Lynn? I'm taking Lynn, yes! Okay. You sound so surprised. We don't have any, like, other than Oswin, we don't really have any, like, Oswin's tanks. enough. Okay, we can skip that part. Sorry about that. Alright, guys. All right. Sorry, <laughs> sorry for the delay that was on me. No, that's fine. So, yeah, we do need to be wise and stock up, so... Lowen could use another sword and another lance. Hey, but you didn't really answer my question about Zelda and uh, voice talent. I said I do not approve of voice even talent if it's, Even games. if it's not Link, but other people? Not really, no. Hmm. Here's here's my thing. The, the if, most voice talent I want in Zelda game is hey. Well, here's the thing. Zelda doesn't really have that much dialogue as is, unless you're talking to like NPCs and stuff all the time. Okay, you no don't. One's going there. It, it's 2016. What's your excuse for not having it? Um, like you don't want to end up like Pajama Sam 4. Well, right, but like Nintendo can actually afford to do it properly. <laughs> I guess it's true. Although, like, every... I, I feel like... Here's my thing with Nintendo. I feel like every time they're like, Hey, every time oh, somebody what? comes to the table and is like, Hey, guys, should we have a... Uh, you know, like, voice acting in the Zelda game? People are like, Yeah, yeah! And then there's one guy who's like, Wait, guys, do you remember Super Mario Sunshine? That had... Mario! How dare you interrupt my... Like, that had full catch. voice down. <laughs> okay... Mario. Steel Lance. Be something, the pollution on the island. <laughs> I am Flood. 
Uh, oh, Where'd you go? It's moving! <laughs> no bars. No bars. Don't no no touch that stuff. Uh, any I, feelings? That game was worth it just for Toadsworth talking and Bowser talking, because Bowser's like, Junior, there's, there's something, something I have, have to tell you about, about Princess Peach. Spoiler, Peach is not Bowser Jr.'s mother. That you know of. <laughs> Peach has I'm to think kidding. about it first. Like, Peach is like, wait a minute, did it? No, I don't think so. Well, I'm positive. Uh, Sarah needs to Peach get is such out of a. There. Okay, here's my thing. Peach she's, is, a, she's a ditz, yeah. Peach is a ditz only in certain games, though. Like, certain games, it's like, Peach is fine. Like, she, pa uh, Paper Mario 2, she's awesome. She can hold her own. And then other games, she's like, did I win? Oh, did I win? You're like, really, Peach, you're that dumb. Like Smash Brothers, you were kicking butt, and now you're like, wait, is, did I- What the- How did Raven miss? He was free feet in front of you! Yeah, well, that's fine. This- this is some baloney. That's a lot of baloney. This is some bat done. Dun da 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 da! Uncle Crenshaw! Oh, you know what I just realized? What? I get Isadora, who she's not that good, but I get an angelic room. Isadora's not bad. But let's be honest, I'm not gonna waste my precious few characters Ooh. that I get, get to pick on Isadora. Matthew's just gonna die if you do that. Look at how many shaman are around that area. Rebecca! <laughs> She's gonna be in the way of the mercenary, so that's not gonna work. Maybe if you put her above the shaman? And then yeah, then Matthew she... kinda block. I don't think the flux will hit, but if it does, she'll be fine, I think. Oh yeah, Rebecca. That's why you. She used her. to hunt deer. Now she hunts humans. <laughs> she could be on like the box of the new Tomb Raider game. <laughs> Tomb Raider 18 <laughs> with Rebecca from Fire Emblem Seven. Yeah. Uh, She's fine. Yeah, but he might not be, because then three different people can attack him. Who? Matthew. I was gonna put him there. Oh well, just don't put him there. What if I put him like over here? Uh. I want him to get experience. Too. That's true. Yeah, yeah, he'll probably be fine. Keyword is probably. Uh, I meant. Well, I'll figure it out. Matthew might die. <laughs> He's not gonna die. The shaman can reach him now. No, they can't. One of them can. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure. Because you moved him one to the right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're right. Eh, he's fine. He's got enough resistance. It should be fine. See, Raven's already almost dead. That's my problem. And I only picked Sarah. And take Priscilla. That's true. Sorry, it does the job, though. Oof. This better miss. Because Sarah can't heal two people. Good. Good, Matthew. Matthew's a pretty good dodge. I forgot machine. how. Let's see, Kanas is not helpful on this level because it's all dark magic. But Kanas has really good resistance, so he actually re doesn't really. So take does damage. Lucius, though, and dark and light magic beats dark magic. That's true, but Lucius if is. If Harry Potter level. taught me anything. Lucius or Lucius is only level 3. Kanas is a level 8. <laughs> uh, I should probably hold back on using Rowan for a bit, because he's like a level 12. Actually, you know what? Hector might be able to take the beating. <laughs> of course, you have to use the wolf bail. Mm. Just so you know, if you want to... Oswin can tank pretty much all those mercenaries. Oh, I know. Which was what I'm planning on doing. He just started as far away from that as possible. Also, I believe Pegasus Knights eventually appear. Yeah, they do. That's why I took Rebecca. And Hector. Rebecca's got some skill with the bow. Yeah. <laughs> she does. That's like all you know about her character. <laughs> unless you do support. Oh, she's an amazing chef as well. Oh, yeah. Bowen, like, falls in love with that's, her just because That's of what her, we uh, call... Flavor text. Oh, <laughs> All right, I'm gonna. No, actually, I can't. Both of those hit. He's screwed, though. Plus, they're gonna hit twice. <laughs> How far can Elwood move? Uh, not not very. <laughs> they can both. If I get the boots in the game, I'm giving them to Oswin. <laughs> or Bowen. That way, he'll just be able to teleport. Basically. I wonder if Kent should rescue her, but then Kent's kind of screwed. Help! Rescue me. That's not gonna do anything. I forgot how many freaky mercenaries are on this level. <laughs> I forget. Yeah, I forgot how tough this level is. 
Yeah, this level's pretty killer. Oh, and because of that, we forgot to save that Raven had balloons. Uh, Darn it. Is this Kent? Kent? Nope. nope. Of course not. Um, this might be one of those things where we can go out of order, like, you move Kent, then I move Sarah, then you have Raven attack or something. Yeah, like let that. me see what you, what you guys, what you do. Okay. While I wait. Well, I you. want to heal Raven. And if you move Kent, I can do that. Uh, you could also heal Matt. Or, no, you can't heal Matt, dude. It's too far. Don't move Oswin down there. We need him over by Rebecca. No, we don't. He'll get slaughtered. No, he won't. He has he exact... Lived, he lived on that last level. He got hit by one feat of magic, and it took out almost like, all of his HP. Well, I don't know what to tell you. Somebody's got to move over there. Oh, Rebecca only has 13 HP. Yeah, that's all oh. I... You said you were gonna move Oswin down there as like a. No, I said I was gonna move Oswin over here so we can take all of these. Oh, okay. Why don't you move Lowen down there? <laughs> you can have Lynn help Matthew take out that one dude. <laughs> I was gonna say since you insisted Fantastic. on taking Lynn. I did insist on taking Lynn. Can Elwood hit him too? Yes, he can. If Matthew moves, he can. Oh man, Elwood, you stink! Nobody attacks twice against them, that's why it's annoying. Please crit, Lynn! Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! You got lucky. <laughs> she does do that a lot. What the heck is going on with my computer screen? Oh. <laughs> Did you pause or something? No, I didn't. The cord was rubbing across my trackpad. That's what was happening. Can I, uh, go back to my track? Yes. Oh, wait, actually. Let's see. Let's change the screen. No! Frame. Yeah. No! I want it pure black, otherwise it's distracting. Fine. Game Boy player, gotta love it. I do love it very much. I just don't want people to have to see, like, outer space or, like, a game well, on the, out the outer so room. Cool. The outer room territory. Oh, man. Try the Iron Blade. No, absolutely not. Hang on, I gotta make sure this is still recording. It is. I'm, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay, good. Immigrants, we get the job done. Wow! Nice, nice Hamilton reference for anybody who. Uh, oh, there was a Hamilton was reference? Oh, I thought you were just being politically incorrect. <laughs> That's not politically incorrect. If by that you mean nice. Alright. It made you made it sound like it's gonna they're passable, but they'll do. No, they get the job done. It is true, they do. Kent's still leveling up quite quickly. You try you keep you always try to make like everything I say a political thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh hang on. Yeah, I gotta move there so Matthew doesn't take a beating. Well, I mean, back when we were talking, like, Americans, America. <laughs> we brought up some gun laws, I believe. <laughs> oh, yeah, we probably did. But in, in jest, obviously. Oh, yes. In character. I'm not going to reveal my thoughts on gun laws on this, uh, let's play. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. It does not seem like the correct avenue for that. Dun, 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 dun. I will say we approve heavily of guns in video games. <laughs> Okay, Heavily. Have... Uh, no! No! Do not do that! Why? No Move reason. him out of there so Oswin can just take it all. Oswin can literally sit right in front of the plank so no one can get in. Alright. Can I move my units? <laughs> Thank you. Tensions are getting tough as Artie and Link move You are about to do a super stupid move and get Sarah killed. She wouldn't have gotten killed, nobody can attack. Because Oswin would have gone there and he wouldn't have been No, but she wouldn't have gotten killed because nobody can attack. Oh, he already has a steel ants. that bow guy. Alright. Oh, also, eventually a ship comes down here as well, so... The Nina, the Pinta, and the Santa Maria. I'm gonna stand in the staircase so no new reinforcements can. Well, actually, no. I see you there. With liberty for all. Yes, still I know. The truth will rise and fall. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's just the way it goes. A word now to the wise. 
The world was made to shoot a gun. <laughs> <laughs> Each day's a surprise. That's the Liberty's Kids theme song, by the way. Oh yeah, great show. Back that was back when people still cared about making TV show theme songs good. Oh yeah. Okay. Let, let's talk about this for a while. The '90s was like the height of good, like theme actually songs. they tried <laughs> yeah. TV show, like theme songs. So you had like many adventures of Winnie the Pooh. That might be the best theme song ever. Great theme Definitely song. Definitely up there. Uh, the Disney oh, come on, Moe, and that was the worst The Disney level. Gummy Bears one. I have literally never heard of that. Oh, well. Okay, anybody watching this channel, stop this video immediately, go look up the Gummy Bears theme song, and then come back. Color 40 does not approve of that. Color 40 wants you to watch his videos. <laughs> well, okay, finish this video, then go look <laughs> yeah. up the Gummy Bears theme song. And leave a like and subscribe if you like. Like and subscribe, <laughs> and then come back. Uh, like and subscribe to the Gummy Bears video. I'm sure no! That guy needs, I'm sure that guy needs views and stuff as well. Well, yes, he definitely needs views. <laughs> Um, I've heard that is a very catchy theme song. Uh, it, it's great. Um, Arthur. I, I know song. Link is a huge fan of the Recess theme song. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> Speaking of America, by the way. It does not sound that patriotic. It has a okay, flute. Okay. Apparently having a flute the, in your theme no, song means the, it's patriotic. The Recess, Disney's Recess, the theme song, is like the most American. It, it makes you just proud to be an American. Does it now? It, it does. It sounds colonial. Seven it's like George plus, Washington right. as he was marching the troops to battle. I'm doing some math, hang on. Uh, okay, yeah. He's probably played the recess theme song to bolster their spirits. It, it, probably. I, I mean, we can only assume, right? I mean, we won the war, right? Uh, I, I, I'm no, counting, I'm not moving when there. I'm counting the recess theme song because that's, you know, we, we won the war with it, so. Um, yeah. Oh, what are some other good ones? Arthur's good. Arf is very uh, good. Wishbone. What's a story, Wishbone? It's a great one. Um, I'm trying to see if Wynn can do something like semi-useful. And now, now okay. you, she can't move down there. She's gonna get killed. Now we get like I, I hate to say lazy ones, but you get ones that are either like so short, or you get ones that are just all instrumental. Like the office. Um, I had a good theme. Do you want to move Matthew back so Sarah can heal him? Yeah, I do. Um, the office had like a good theme song. But, like, it, you know, it's just instrumental. Like, you don't have, like, your amazing Yeah, move some of your vocals. guys before I move uh, Lowen You're or You're not Oswin. even listening hey, to my hey, amazing... Hey, that's okay. my guy. Fine. You're not even listening to my amazing discussion. Because I was TV. doing some strategy. All right, sorry. What were you asking me? I I'm talking about great 90s TV show themes. I was contributing to that pretty heavily. I said many, many ones. I got you started on that whole... Yeah, but then I'm just... Tangent. It's like I'm talking to a wall. That's like... All of my soul let's plays. <laughs> yeah, but that's like the point. This is the point of us having two people here is so we can like have a cool dialogue. All right, fine. You want me to list some cool '90s TV theme uh, show yeah, theme songs that I haven't named? All right. Well, I was tuning out. <laughs> I had a small piece of fluff going in my ear, so I didn't really hear it. Uh, let's see. '90s theme song. was Clifford for the '90s. Mm, I love that's Clifford probably early Red 2000s, Dog. but I'll allow it. Okay. That, was that a great theme song, though? Okay, okay. Also, I you, love Clifford okay, the Big Red Dog. Speaking of Clifford the Big Red Dog, that show and book series, whatever you want to call it, makes literally no sense because it's like <laughs> the premise of it is that, like, Clifford, you know, like the theme I'll just recite the theme song verbatim. Clifford needed Emily, so, so she, she shows him, him for, her, for her own. Oh, then, the, I, oh, then, the love, then the love made Clifford grow so big that the Howards had to leave their home. So, what? Okay. That's so, not how I thought the thief saw it. Yeah. <laughs> so okay, so here's the thing. So okay, so A we have some we already have some problems here. So yes. the love of having a family made Clifford grow that big. Never heard of that happening. Does that mean they don't <laughs> is, is Clifford a magical dog if it's fueled by love? Or if you love anything that much would it grow that big? Like, I don't think Elizabeth is a Apparently, small wow. child. Does that mean George Shrinks has a blue we know of in his Yeah, life? oh nobody <laughs> likes that kid. That, that's yeah. I nobody bad, likes I that kid. I feel bad for that kid. No, okay, so then okay. Then the thing so they have to leave their home, right? They move okay. from like New York City. Okay, great. Small apartment, expensive rent, giant dog. Makes sense. <laughs> to a tiny to, island. To a remote dog bone shaped island with this giant dog. Ooh, he's, long sword. he's in a smaller space than he was. It makes no sense. The price of importing dog food for Clifford must cost more than their apartment oh, rent. You go first. Like turn. in. New yeah. York City or wherever they live. Okay, I, I, I thought the theme song went Clifford needed Emily so she chose him for her dog. Then one day Clifford grew so big that the Howards had to leave their home. I thought it was just like he, it, randomly he grew so big. Which I think I, makes I more mean, sense than maybe. I mean, I, I'm growing him that big. 
No, they Ooh, definitely Armor say Slayer it. only okay, you can look You can look this up on your phone or something, but I'm pretty sure I had the lyrics right. Uh, well... Where did my phone... Oh, my phone's on my dresser. Uh, you'd have to hand it to me. I will uh, do that. Sure, I am looking up... Ladies and gentlemen, in the middle of our Fire Emblem Let's Play, I am looking up the lyrics to the Clifford the Big Red Dog theme song. It, I mean, stranger things have happened. I have they? I spoiled up. Is that really more awkward? Let's see. Clifford... Theme song lyrics. Also, how come, like... How come everybody on the island is just cool with Clifford? Like, it's, he's not like a tourist he's awesome. attraction. awesome! He's a super smart No, guy. I know. But like, he's not a tourist attraction. Like, wouldn't it be like, come see this giant Oh, uh, no, Link was dollar. right. Link was right. Yes, thank you. Clifford's the best friend anyone could know. He's the greatest dog ever. I really think so. <laughs> but those lyrics are just not good. So they packed up the family- How did Clifford fit in the family car anyways? I think- or did he just walk? I think he might just walk, or he's like on the roof or something. He walks to an island. <laughs> uh oh. Kent only has six health. Uh oh. Hope no, but I like, hope Kent Clifford not is die. just a problematic show. No, Ellie's oh, gonna oh, take out Oh, it's your turn. Guy. No, no, no. Ellie's gonna take out Kent. <laughs> we just ditches Kent. <laughs> oh, that'd be, I'd be so mad. Oh, yeah, that would be a huge jerk move. Fortunately, Colorful already prides himself on not being a jerk. I really Intentionally. Think so. Yeah, no one can finish him off. I mean, Clifford is so much fun, he's a friend to us all. I love okay, Clifford. Okay, so you've named one TV dog. show themes. Uh, Emmy wished on a dragon scale, and that's what started Dragon Tales. You're the Dragon Tales generation. Dragon Tales dealt with serious issues, alright? Like speaking Spanish. <laughs> Having a grudge. No, like moving to a strange world. Being confronted by your greatest fears, trying to... new things that scare uh, you. Well, I mean, so change. does so does Sesame Street. Yeah, Sesame Street dealt with uh, deep themes. You really want to do that? No, I'm just checking. <laughs> do you seriously want to do that? All Rupert right. is so much fun. He's written this. I really I, okay. Need to my, heal here's Moen. my thing with Dragon Tales. I just did not get into it. Like it. The burping rock turned you off, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, there was an episode where a rock burped. You see, that it's a bad thing. Didn't they replace one of the kids with, like, a different Spanish-speaking kid? Okay, I don't know what was going on with the yellow shirt kid, honestly. Remember, um, that one episode where they're, like, trapped in this place, unless the one guy, like, the big yeah, guy... Yeah, Kingdom Come! Yeah, it deals the with one the guy, afterlife. Yeah, uh, kind of, except for they're not dead. Yeah, okay, like, so there's an like, episode basically, like... There's like a big dragon ord who's who was like kind of greedy and like very afraid basically, and like they go to a weird like it's like a sports stadium almost where it's called Kingdom Come, where it's basically like and they like the guy like who like owns it like traps them there. He's basically like, well like ord like either like you and all of your friends can stay here for all eternity. He's like oh you can share your cupcake with me and he's like he's I don't know. And it's like really ord come on. And it's also like the biggest cupcake you've ever seen. It's, oh yeah, like, bigger it, than. A normal huge. cake. I mean, <laughs> yeah. He is a dragon, but it's still like it's not the it's if he's bigger than his it, face. It's bigger than his face. Like he's just a pig. <laughs> and he's like, oh, sharing is hard. I don't know. Yeah, doesn't the guy eventually like the guy kind of backs down? And is like, I'll take like half of your cupcake. He just <laughs> and has to share it, like, not give it to him. He, he just right. and he wanted still, to teach Ord how to share. And he's still basically like, I don't know. I I might value this cupcake more than my friends, friends seem like lives and my lives. <laughs> Dragon Tales was just, I don't know, it was and not my favorite. Yeah, Cyber Chase. Uh, not a great theme song, but it was a good show. Um, oh, oh, the 90s uh, Carmen Sandiego uh, game. Oh, please tell me that guy cannot reach nope, Elwood. Can't. Uh, it's gonna be close. If he can, Elwood may die. Oh, well. Called it. That I, bad. Am I would be so mad if we were restart this level. I'd probably be done for the night. Probably, yeah. You'd have like a half let's play. Half a let's play. I at least got one. Okay, so like, let's, out of say, this. let's say we play Cog of Destiny or, or one of the later levels that's super long. And we like, should and like, <laughs> and Elwood dies at like the last second. Would that be a video where we go all the way up to him dying, and then you have to watch a different I, one? Maybe. All right, Oswin can finish off this guy. Lowen needs to go help out with the shaman. We're gonna have the uh, move other Hector show up down soon. here. I, I will. You gotta move your guys first. All your, right. your, your, you gotta move your mans. Lin is not a man, thank you very much. You're, you're woman's too. Yes, are woman's, not women. Nope. Um. 
Uh, how, what's your range like, dude? Oh, sweet. Awesome, we can just wait. This is a great Game Boy Advance game. Game Boy Advance just Absolutely. I know we said that already. All right, Link. Really right. uh, can't a six health. I know, I know. Cat has no bullets. Sarah can heal him next. Oh, or, whoa, Raven's hogging all the bullets. Yeah, because I bought a bunch. That explains it. Oh, there and there the goes Wii the Wii U Sensibar R. Well, you did kick the... Oh, that's not what I was trying to do, but... Oh yeah, Pure Water. Pure Water's weird, it increases your resistance for, like, a few turns. Yeah. Also, the so, boss is a shaman, he has a tome called Luna. I don't think we're gonna try to... Yeah, boss. probably not. Luna is a really overpowered tome. It's got a really high critical rating. It pierces resistance, so there's literally no protection against it. It's... yeah, it's... So basically, if somebody gets lucky with it, like, you're dead. Yep. Now, granted, the enemies don't, um, critical as much. Kill Rebecca. Crit him! I just wanted to make sure she wouldn't die first. Right. Because I was trying to heal her last turn and I messed up the button combination. So this is the first level where we have a bunch of people like almost dead. Yep. Ooh, she leveled up strength and defense. That's pretty good. Rebecca rarely does that, so... What's this guy's movement? Okay. Uh, Lowen can take that guy out. You know, Lando has some guys who can fix him up. The ladies, man. Yeah, I know all. He's the that. ladies' choice. Okay, if there was, so they're making all these Star Wars movies now. You know, you have Episode the Force Seven. Force Awakens. That's it. <laughs> no, no, no. But they're making Rogue One, which is the one that it's not a numbered one, but it takes place, um, like in between Episodes three and four, and it's about oh. the guys who steal the plans for the Death Star. They're making a Han Solo movie. Of course they are. With Yon, but it's Yon Han Solo. <laughs> Is Harrison Ford playing Yon no, Han Solo? No, no, no. okay. Um, they I can't How's think of the guy, I can't think of the guy's name, but they've announced okay. uh, who, who's playing him. No, no, no. But they're doing all these Star Wars movies. They've talked about a Boba Fett movie. They've talked about a Yoda movie. I would see a Boba Fett. Movie. Okay, I would <laughs> see a Lando Calrissian like rise to power movie because like you like a political thriller because you know that dude did not become the leader of Cloud City in a legitimate way. <laughs> he totally, like, cheated his way to the top, like, Breaking Bad style or something. Oh, absolutely. Uh, that's pop. You can't it's tell possible. Me, you can't tell me you think Lando, like, honestly was, like, elected the leader of Cloud City. He has the charisma of a leader. He does, but he also has the charisma of somebody who cheated his way to the top. He just made a deal that will keep no. the- Whoa! Nice level up! That was a good level up. I am picturing <laughs> this Lando movie. It would basically be- Who it, needs healing the most? Uh, Rebecca. <laughs> Definitely, Rebecca. Um, I am basically. No, for your citizens. I'm picturing this Lando yeah. movie. It would just be called Calrissian. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like the title already. Yep, and it would basically be Lando starting from nothing and working his way up to being something. The impressive man that we know him as he is. Like there'd be little moments where you're like, uh, where it's like he gets like <laughs> somebody's like, you should wear a cape. He's like, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> stuff like that. Like you find out that like, I don't know. You find out that he's not who you really think he is, which is definitely a right. Role, yeah. Definitely need one heal he's staff a at least. Dude. And a men's staff, I'll take. And two. It would be like a mixture of like between Breaking Bad and House of Cards. Starring Lando Haven't seen in House Cloud of Cards. City. I have not really seen House of Cards either. Haven't seen Breaking Bad either. I honestly don't think that's the type of movie that I would like to watch. No no no. I'm not, I'm not yes. saying it would be Breaking Bad's a movie, people. No, I'm not saying I'm not saying it would be like that edgy, it would just be that style of story where it's like, Lando's not really a good guy, and it's like all about his rise to power. <laughs> power! Okay, uh, why did this other ship not appear yet? It appears in a bit. Uh, I think I've moved all the guys I want to. Also, I know I've told you before, here's my idea for a Boba Fett movie. Okay, oh, wait, okay Link has like the best idea. Yeah, for so while you're, while you're moving your guys, okay, Boba Fett movie, so... Um, this, the, do you want to move any Oh, is it? Because I, honestly, I don't, I'm happy with their positions. Yeah, I'm fine with these guys' positions, too. Alright, well, you go first on the next one, so... Oh. Yeah, so, Boba Fett okay, movie. Okay, Boba Fett movie. Okay, so, it 
Oh, there you go. The other ship's showing up. Okay, so Boba Fett movie opens. Boba Fett is fighting like an unnamed Jedi. Okay, mm -hmm. like I, I would assume this takes place. Uh, well, actually, hang on. You know how like in the new shows and stuff, it's like, well, not all the Jedi died in like the Order, or whatever. Yeah, like, apparently Ahsoka yeah, like, survived, and several others. Anyways, so it's like, yeah, there's like some, or maybe it's not even a Jedi, but some dude with lightsaber. He's fighting some dude with lightsaber, basically. And, the, you know, he's doing well, it's like this epic action scene, you're like, Boba's got this, oh yeah. And then the guy just, like, beheads Boba Fett. And you're like, <laughs> it'll be like the biggest, just like, what? And then that guy takes, takes armor. Boba Fett's armor and helmet and becomes the new Boba Fett. Because that would, think about it, the best part about Boba Fett in episodes, um, in, in Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi, was that, like, nobody knew who the heck this dude was. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. He's just this enigma. And then we find out that he's, he's really like a just, really cool bounty really, hunter. Really, he's just a clone of like a lamer bounty hunter who like saw his dad die as a baby. <laughs> like, and that's just no terrible. one likes that. Like, no, it was terrible. That was no one. So, uh, well, Hollywood is kind of beat up. And, oh, no, he's no, he's not. He has four. <laughs> he can do his own thing. Um, You're going to steal my chaos? I'm going to steal your chaos. Raven needs some healing. Raven, he we needs, will see. He needs Queen food Alidala. badly. Um, no, but that wouldn't that be like a great yeah. yeah, almost as good as our idea for Toy Story Four. Oh yeah, that would also be like a gritty political thrill. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually more like a romantic comedy. Yeah, Toy Story Four romantic comedy. That's actually what they're doing. I, I, uh, I, I, they do not need a Toy Story Four. Basically, I'm sure it'll be great because it's Pixar, and Pixar is usually yep. great with few exceptions. Um, but. Uh, or Matthew has some guys who could finish him off. You know, Matthew is probably going to get creamed by these dudes. Well, Hector could one-hit kill that shaman. That's true. You're right. Um, well, now he can't because you moved him in the wrong place. You were supposed to have Hector move first. Well, Hector is a hand axe. No, he, he has a hand axe. He has a hand axe, but it's less accurate. What do you think? Cut to Matthew dying in two seconds. No! <laughs> <laughs> if Matthew dies in two seconds, I might cut it at that point. Oh, never mind. <laughs> yeah, uh, Hector got this. Hector, baby. Hector's gonna, like, be level 20 really soon. <laughs> He's already, like, well, at that point, you could just stop taking him on the levels. That's true. That's true. Uh, yeah. It's all my guys. Well, you. I got this. I really wish Pixar people aren't watching these videos for colorful art. <laughs> Actually, are, they're not, are they watch really? I think they're they're not watch watching these videos at all right now because they are not up yet. Well, I think the, by this point, they'll be watching it for my hilarious, uh, commentary on and ruining and the endings spoilers. to various Pixar movies. I've only done that literally with one movie. Alright. So with Toy Story 3 where they all <laughs> almost die. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. I've spoiled my versions of Star Wars movies. That aren't even out yet. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah, I don't think that's spoilers. It cuts to like four years from now when this video actually goes up and uh, four years it's gonna be up faster than that okay cut to when this video actually goes up and there's a lando calrissian movie called calrissian <laughs> <laughs> just making sure while i will not double shot this guy oh he actually won't oh sweet really lowen <laughs> the one time i don't want you to do a critical <laughs> never miss low oh and he doesn't get a level up even that's like the biggest slap in the face ever yeah. all right <laughs> I guess Lynn will just wait here for the Pegasus Knights. Sounds good to me. Move Oswin, he needs some action. <laughs> Calrissian. <laughs> It'd be great. I'm trying to think of like a good tagline that involves being here in the clouds. <laughs> <laughs> in May, we hope to see you here in the clouds. Yeah, that's uh, bad. <laughs> It would definitely have Lobot in it as well. <laughs> would he be like a main character or just like a one-off? Like, hey, it's Lobot! He'd be like Lando's friend. <laughs> Who like Lando is like kind of a jerk too, but he like still sticks with Lando because he's a good person. Lobot it would also explain why person. he has like the robotic back of his head. I thought it was just like Bluetooth gone crazy. Oh, I mean, maybe. It would explain why he's like basically a cyborg. <laughs> he's like a reverse- WHAT THE HECK?! Man. Two criticals in a row so with a 4% he's no, chance. He's no Miss Lowen and critical. Crit Rowan. Crit Rowan. <laughs> ro ro Rowan. Rowan? Ruby Roo? So, yeah. Oh, did I tell you that, um... Did I tell you apparently they're making a animated Scooby-Doo movie? Oh, or, I or like, I don't... Guy. 
Well, no, okay. I don't think it's like... You know how they've been doing, like, Scooby-Doo meets, like, the whole Hogan! Scooby, Scooby-Doo meets Hulk Hogan! Yeah. Like, yeah, but this movie... Okay, I think this is actually more like... Do you remember the people Scooby-Doo that was terrible? I never saw it, but I heard it was terrible. Okay. It's gonna be basically like that, I think. Where well, it's like, like half Oh, well, action, when did Elwood get a guiding ring? Um... One of my co-workers' brother... Hang on, see, just see how Rebecca does against the boss. Okay. One of my co-workers' brothers... Uh, no, uh, no, don't risk that. 15% works for an animation studio that is apparently working on this uh, Scooby-Doo project. <laughs> <laughs> and apparently it keeps getting shelved over and over again. Because they can't Scooby's agree... They can't agree on the plot. Okay! Personally, when I, I think uh, of Scooby-Doo, I think of uh, Scooby-Doo, Where Are You, which didn't have a, that much sure. of a plot, but... Now, you can take, you can choose to believe this or not. Um, I also have an uncle who works at Nintendo, so, you know. <laughs> That's, like, what every little kid always, always, always said, I feel, like, on playgrounds and stuff. I have an uncle who works My at Nintendo. My uncle works for Nintendo, and the DS is gonna have three screens, or the 3DS <laughs> will have three screens. And five dimensions. It will play GameCube games. Just run right off the disc. <laughs> that sounds like something that was rumored. Yes. Kind of like how in Star Wars Episode One there are going to be lightsaber knives. Oh yeah. One of my friends. Okay, so uh, Artie's a little bit younger than me, but back in the day, I was uh, prime age. I will just say when Star Wars Episode One came out, <laughs> and me and my friends were deep, deep into the rumors. And one of my friends insisted that he had heard that there were going to be lightsaber knives in the movie. And we, for some reason, we were like, oh, that's so cool! Even though the are like, wait, that's actually super stupid. Oh. Yeah, it would be super stupid. <laughs> Wind might be in over her head. Not really. She can backtrack. Will so. Bowen do a f critical three times in a row? <laughs> she won't get the chance. You're not going to get the chance. It's a Kent misses, Hector misses, Raven misses. <laughs> Kent would have to miss twice. I mean, he might. He only has like a two thirds. Well, he chance can't of miss twice. Dun, 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 dun. I need to stop doing that. You're just like spiking your own videos audio wise. Yep. <laughs> Oh yeah, Merlinus. No one like attacks Merlinus on this level. Nope. We only have one more turn. We have to survive four too. So. Oh really? Uh, I'm not going. I just seen how she fares. Nope. I'm not doing that. Don't worry. You better have her backtrack. Or have Oz would kill one of the guys. Iron sword. Iron sword. How much movement do these guys have? Uh, movement fly. One two. I would be happy Beautiful. if they just made, like, a normal Scooby-Doo show. Would you? Would yeah. you really watch it, though? I probably wouldn't, in all honesty, but I would be happy for the next generation instead of having, like, garbage, like, uh, um, pup named Scooby-Doo, which I, I Don't guess... Dis pup named Scooby-Doo. Yeah, <laughs> that was a decent show. Uh, I did not say I did not say great show. It was decent. decent, I guess. Or like, um, what's new Scooby Doo is better though. What's new Scooby Doo? And, uh, Probably is. What's what's the Mystery Incorporated? Mystery it's Incorporated was not very good. And it's, then, it's trying to be have a completely serious okay, plot. It's like, there's oh, yeah, a new Shaggy's one. He's like uh, dating Velma. There's a new yeah. It actually it was like an anime and had like plot that extended from episode to episode. <laughs> I love that the Armor Slayer only damages Oswin. <laughs> no, there was a new one though. I can't think of the name of it, but I think it has like. It, it, I think it's on WB Kids. Come on, Lynn. And it literally has Family yes! Guy animation. Like, it looks like Family Guy. Like, it looks like a Family Guy uh, okay. like spoof. We're not allowed to talk about that on my channel. Oh, I'm not going to talk about <laughs> Family Guy is really dumb. You're not missing anything. Watch Hardy's channel instead of Family Guy. It's weird. Yeah. Um, but it, the animation style looks exactly like it, and it's ridiculous. I can't guarantee it'll be funnier than Family Actually, I kind of can. <laughs> family Guy is not funny to me personally, but uh, a lot of people love it, so... I don't want to insult any of your fans from the Lennings forums who love Family Guy as well. Actually, that's a good call, because I have heard a few people talk about Family Guy on that. Oh, well, all you Lemmings guys... I, I don't think a whole lot of the Lemmings guys, guys are going to be watching this. Probably. No gals! <laughs> well, yeah, we just talked about that in a previous video. <laughs> uh, you can just end that up here. Alright. 
Ahoy, I'm back! Now who wants to die first? Well, are we you got ready, left. kids? <laughs> We've rooted him! Also, okay, I know we, we've talked about Spongebob already, but... Oh, wow. Uh, <laughs> so, that, uh... The part at the beginning with the weird mouth, like the weird creepily human mouth... <laughs> is that Mr. Krabs? He sounds exactly like Mr. Krabs! Uh... <laughs> Definitely the same voice actor. Yeah, I, that's gonna be a question for the Spongebob fans to have to answer. All you fans from the Lemmings forums who are also Spongebob <laughs> fans, which the Venn diagram is probably pretty small. But, you know, maybe? <laughs> well, I mean, the, the sound off Lemmings in, fans itself is very small. Sound well. off in the comments below. <laughs> There's probably one one guy who's like, oh, yes. Yeah, so you know what? what? I pretty much guarantee when this video goes up, maybe not immediately, but eventually we're gonna get a comment that's like, oh, yeah, I can't have to since you keep saying, are you ready, kids? I will be <laughs> So so happy to see that. <laughs> Please, you will make my day, anybody, if you comment. Honestly, well, do you even have like your own YouTube account? Uh, no, no. I yeah, mean, I, I do so. in that I have a Google account. Oh but yeah, I do but not you have a. Like, I don't have a channel yeah. or anything. Spoiler alert for the next level. Next level is fog again. Yeah. It's a. It's, it's an annoying hard. one. It's not that hard. The we pirate, also have to be quick if we want word. the side quest. What's the side quest after that? Imprisoner of Magic. Uh, yeah. And I get Dart. Dart's pretty good. Dart is very good. Kadas is better. They're different. Kadas is probably better. Good thing they're Since he's got access to various tools. Lynn must have gotten over does. her prejudice. Yeah, apparently. A uh, single voyage with pirates has gotten her Kids, over her it's a learning deep, deep prejudice. Today, on a very special episode of Fire Emblem. <laughs> <laughs> is it? Well, I guess it's pretty special. Let's make preparations to enter the forest. Like, what preparations do you need? Foreshadowing. Well, that's all the time we have today. I'm Colorful Artie. And I'm Link the Hero 64. And we'll see you for the next episode where we talk about more TV shows and maybe spoil some more stuff for you guys. God made you special, and he loves you very much. Yes, he does. <laughs>